This is a quick video review of the Sharp Tools material redesign. So as a refresher, uh, Sharp Tools is a set of widgets and tasker plugins for smart things on the Android platform. So on my home screen, I'm showing a couple of different widgets. The icons uh, that are showing the light icon are thing widgets, which can do things like uh, change your thermostat or toggle a light on or off or turn a light off. And then off on the left hand side, I have a phrase or hello home widget, which allows me to execute a phrase like turn off everything but bedroom or uh, any other phrase type of uh, activity that you have. But the main purpose of this video is to show the material redesign of Sharp Tools. And this is a pretty major redesign of the application. So what we're showing is an Android material style layout, and this is a cards type of view. So you can see that different device types each have different types of cards. So in this case, I'm showing a number of uh, dimmable lights and light switches. And if I scroll toward the bottom, I'll see some of my devices like motion sensors and uh, thermostats. So scrolling up and showing some of the actions, um, take for instance this light. Um, we can tap on the on button and the light will come on or we can tap the off button and the light should turn off. And those states are reflected using material style colors. So the light actually reflects that uh, deep indigo or deep purple color. And as I scroll up to different devices, if I wanted to take the bedside lamp, for example, and dim that down to around 50%, I can just easily swipe down and uh, change the dim level. Or if I wanted to turn the device off, I could do that relatively easy as well. So one of the other nice features is in the settings, we now have the capability to um, automatically refresh your things, whether that be on a timed interval or when the application first starts. So I can turn on automatically refresh and choose to refresh every 10 seconds, 15 seconds, etc. So by default, that's 10 seconds, and I'll leave that where it is. I'll also show you that if I change the theme, I can change to various different themes which for right now I just have created a couple, uh, indigo, red, and green, but I plan on creating a few more. So I'll show you how that works. As I switch back to the application, you can see that it's now um, material redesign, uh, but in a green color. And we can see that the bedside lamp, actually as we loaded up the application, it attempted to go out and query smart things and got the updated state of the device. So that's a pretty quick overview of the material redesign of Sharp Tools. I hope you guys like it. So this video is a follow-up to my previous video where I showed the Sharp Tools material redesign on a tablet. So in this case, I wanted to show you what the Sharp Tools material redesign looks like on a phone. So I'll open up Sharp Tools, and you'll see that it loads similarly pretty quick. Um, it automatically performs a refresh on first load. And what you'll see is that um, I can long press on a device and subscribe to various different attributes. So in this case, I'm gonna to subscribe to the switch uh, state. So whenever the switch changes on the device, uh, I'll get updates, I'll get push events to my, my phone. And I can react to these push events in Tasker to do some pretty cool things. So what you can see is that this device now shows a um, star icon in the top right showing that I'm now subscribed to it. So I'm gonna scroll down to one of the devices that we were playing with in the previous demo the fake light. So in this case, uh, what we'll see is that whenever I um, toggle this device, I'm subscribed to it, and I have a notification set which will show the current state of the device. So this is a really simple example of push events in Tasker. So what you'll see is at the top of the screen in the uh, notification or status bar, we'll actually see that push event occur. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the light off. What you'll see is that the light goes off, and within just a second, um, a push event comes through that Tasker reacts to. And similarly, I can turn that device back on and we'll see a push event come through and we can see that the device is now switched back on. Similar to the tablet type of layout, I can come into my settings and I can change my theme. So I'll change to the green theme. And as I switch back, we can see that the theme changes over just like uh, it did on the tablet edition. So again, that's a really quick preview of the material redesign of Sharp Tools.